Do not buy another VR headset. Not yet. Because everything you think you know about virtual and mixed reality is about to become obsolete. We are entering a war for the future of computing, a battle waged not on monitors or phones, but in the space around you. And the next weapon in Meta's arsenal, codenamed internally, is not just the Quest 4. It's the device designed to finally put a nail in the coffin of every competitor, including the $3,500 behemoth from Cupertino. For months, the leaks have been fragments, whispers of a new design, a revolutionary display, and a price point that defies logic. But now, those fragments are coming together to reveal a complete, terrifying picture for the competition. This isn't just an incremental update. This is Meta's all-in bet on the metaverse, productivity, and most importantly on you. In the next 30 minutes, we are going to expose the classified specs. The retina-shattering new display technology. The extreme comfort design that ditches the bulk, the massive leap in processing power, and the single feature that Meta has stolen from their rivals to make the Quest 4 unstoppable. If you are a gamer, a creator, or just someone who believes the future is spatial, you cannot afford to look away. This is the Meta Quest 4. And this is everything they don't want you to know. Let's begin with the elephant in the room. Wait. Previous Quest headsets, while revolutionary, were undeniably bulky. The Quest 4 changes the physics of VR. The most persistent and electrifying leak revolves around a drastically reduced form factor. We are talking about a headset that is rumored to be closer to a thick pair of ski goggles than a traditional VR mask. How do they achieve this? By committing to an external battery and compute pack, often described as a puck or a separate module. This is the design choice that separates the consumer quest line from the professional realm. Removing the thermal and weight constraints from your face and distributing the load across your body or pocket. It's a design philosophy copied directly from high-end rivals, but delivered at a consumer price point. The result is a headset that you can actually wear for hours without fatigue. Furthermore, we are hearing strong whispers about the integration of a built-in, high-quality, elite strap as standard. No more aftermarket purchases. Meta is finally acknowledging that comfort is not a premium accessory. It is a mandatory feature for mass adoption. This focus on long-duration comfort is the key to unlocking the true potential of mixed reality productivity. The single biggest upgrade and the source of the most excitement is the display. The Quest 3 used excellent LCDs, but the Quest 4 is rumored to be making the leap back to a superior technology. OLED or mini-LED panels. This is critical. Why? Because it delivers infinite contrast, true blacks and colors that simply pop, pushing us closer to retina-level resolution. The immersion factor here is not just an improvement. It's a transformation. But the real magic happens with mixed reality. The pass-through on the Quest 3 was good, but the Quest 4 is rumored to feature significantly higher resolution cameras. Some leaks hint at 80 megapixel cameras per eye, running at a high frame rate. This is the visual touring test in action. The goal is to make the virtual world indistinguishable from your real environment, eliminating the grainy, low-fidelity look of current mixed reality. Imagine professional work where you can see your real keyboard perfectly while virtual screens float 